LongBeachReport.com is in East Long Beach, where an estimated five to 600 students, teachers, and parents gathered on Saturday morning, January 22nd, to get pre-race instructions as they prepare to compete in the second annual Long Beach Solar Grand Prix. The solar-powered model car race is scheduled for April 9th in El Dorado Park. Teams of middle and high school students are given solar panels and a small electric motor and then apply their scientific engineering and creative talents and any materials they choose to build a model car powered entirely by the sun. Their team's car then races against similarly created solar powered model cars built by other teams. The event has grown beyond expectations. In January 2010, a little over 200 people attended the organizational meeting, but this year's response was over twice that. It required organizers to use Long Beach Water Department's large auditorium, and what you see on this video are just the middle school teams. A separate wave of teams from high schools arrived about 90 minutes later. We have had such a tremendous response from the schools and the students and the scout troops and others that we are just, we are so excited. This is going to be the best Silver Grand Prix that we've had. But you need to know who helped pay um, for the uh, silver car kits. Those, those kits are about $29 a piece. And I was able to raise funds from sponsors, as we did last year, to be able to make sure that every team has a solar car kit. Um, and also, um, when we do the race on April the 9th, we have to thank the uh, Carpenters Union because they built the track last year. Because we have so many teams this year, they're building a second track so we can run um, more races, more heats, and get it done with. But the sponsors that paid for these, these cars today are IBEW, uh, those the Electrician, uh, Local Union 11, Southern California Edison, Progressive Power Group, uh, Fat Energy, SA Recycling, uh, P2S Engineering, the Long Beach Lifeguard Association, ABC Solar, Ameco Solar, and Dr. Mike Walter. Dr. Mike Walter, if you know the pyramid over at Cal State Long Beach, that blue pyramid, that's the Walter Pyramid. And he's extremely uh, involved and um, concerned about providing activities for young people, so we want to thank him for his generosity. Uh, Teams consist of two to four members plus a coach, teacher, parent, or other volunteer. Awards go to the middle and high school teams with the fastest vehicle and for design. The message really here is, is a good one. We really don't need to be addicted to fossil fuels to power our transportation nor to produce power for our, our homes. In East Long Beach, Bill Pearl, LBReport.com, and we're everywhere.